For the first time, we were able to restore a real-time sensory feeling in an amputee while he was controlling the sensorized hand. It was quite amazing because uh, suddenly I could feel something that I haven't been uh, feeling for, for nine years. My kids, they, they, they thought it was, was cool. They even called me the cable guy. We performed a four-week clinical trial implanting electrodes into the peripheral nerves the hand has several sensors attached to each tendon of each finger. We can use these sensors to understand the level of force the patient was performing while grasping an object. We use this force information to deliver very precise stimulation to the different sensory nerves in order to restore this real-time sensory feeling into the nervous system. You can feel round things and hard things and soft things. And the feedback was totally new to me and, and suddenly Soft. when I was doing some movements uh, I could uh, feel actually what I was doing uh, instead of looking what I was doing. I would love to have it, uh, the new prosthesis because it, it's so amazing to, to feel something that you haven't been able to feel for, for so many years. The participant is provided with myoelectric control over several different hand movements. Muscle signals are decoded in real time and motor commands are immediately transmitted to the robotic hand. Electrodes have been implanted in the median and ulnar nerve of the left arm. To feel an object that is in contact with the prosthetic hand, the electrodes deliver electrical stimuli to the nerves that were proportional to the finger sensor readouts. In more than 700 trials, the subject showed that it could modulate force and grasp and identify physical characteristics of different types of objects. He could tell the difference in stiffness between cotton balls, plastic glasses and a piece of wood. He could sense some geometric properties of shape, as the curvature of a baseball or the cylinder that is a water bottle. He could use the restored tactile information to apply the appropriate grasp and handle different objects without watching. This approach could improve the efficacy and lifelike quality of hand prosthesis, resulting in a keystone strategy for the near natural replacement of missing hands. Soft. Hot. Medium. 